Ah! One of the corrupted! The corrupted? Where? Diamant! Help! <laughs> Whew. Thanks for the save, Diamant. Sorry to trouble you like that. No trouble at all. However, I must ask, how did that creature manage to overpower and frighten the Divine One? It came out of nowhere. I just started running. I'm not really good with the Corrupted. Not good with them? You handle them in battle just fine. It's different on the battlefield. I can spot them first, then steal myself before engaging. That last Corrupted soldier got the drop on me. My guard was down. I'm an easy target for them outside of battle. Hmm, I don't follow. Isn't there something that makes your skin crawl, Diamant? I suppose... Hairy caterpillars can have that sort of effect on me. Okay. Let's say... You knew you were about to see a big caterpillar. You'd have a chance to prepare. Now, imagine you're eating dinner at home, and a caterpillar suddenly drops onto your plate. Hmm... Wouldn't that startle you? Wouldn't you cry out in surprise? I probably would. That's what sneak attacks from the Corrupted feel like. Caterpillars dropping on my plate. I understand. Very clear explanation, Divine One. That was a strange example, but I'm glad you followed it. Sorry you had to watch me struggle like that. How unflattering. <sighs> I wish I was flawless like you, Diamant. Flawless? That's the most concerned I've ever seen you look, Diamant. Oh, Divine One. I apologize. Didn't think anyone else was here. What's that you're holding? This is a medal my father gave me a while back. A commendation from the King. From King Morian? I was with our troops during an intense battle against Illusia. We found ourselves surrounded. We needed to make a quick retreat, so I took command out of sheer desperation. When we returned, Father gave me this medal. It felt like the first time he saw me as a leader, but occasionally, I wonder. Was it my leadership that got us home, or was it pure luck? Perhaps I didn't earn this. So even the Crown Prince of Brodia suffers through moments of self-doubt. Sorry to shatter the illusion. To protect my country's reputation, I must insist you keep this conversation private. Of course. You saw me in a vulnerable moment with that corrupted soldier. So let's call it even. But I will say one thing. Hmm. Knowing that you do have a vulnerable side makes me feel a bit closer to you. Vulnerability isn't always a bad thing. <laughs> You're a peculiar leader, Divine One. Divine One, are you training? Yes. I can't shake this feeling that I'm not strong enough. The truth is, I'm worried, and I feel weak. <laughs> How can I restore peace to the world in this state? Huh. What is it, Diamant? It's just surprising. I never would have guessed that the Divine One had doubts like this. Of course I do. I worry a lot. My plate is full, and caterpillars keep dropping on it. <laughs> you know what I mean, right? Yes. And I see what you meant earlier about vulnerability. I feel closer to you, too. Really? All of a sudden? But you've seen this side of me before. I fled from that corrupted soldier in such a panic. <laughs> I remember. What I mean is, you make me feel safe enough to discuss my deepest concerns. If it weren't for you, I might still be clutching that medal and thinking about my father. I'm grateful for that. Thank you, Divine One. I feel the same way. I appreciate having an ally to confide in, too. I suspect we have a lot in common. You might be right. Let's keep this up. We may seem guarded to the others, but I'll always be open to chat with you.
Divine One, is this a good time to talk? Sure. What is it, Diamant? I'd like for you to have this. You're giving me a ring? I am. It's made from the metal my father gave to me. I had it melted down and recast. The metal from your father? Why would you do that? It was so important to you. In Brodia, metals and tokens change form whenever they change hands. It's tradition. I don't know about this. I couldn't possibly take something so precious from you. You wanted us to keep relying on each other, right? And offer mutual support? Think of this as a reminder. I'll always be around when you need me. I see. So, will you accept the ring, Divine One? Well, Diamant, I'm not sure I'm worthy of such a personal gift. I guess I'll just have to do everything I can to live up to this. So you will accept it? I will. I'm glad to hear it, Divine One. This is actually pretty funny. I have something I'd like to give you as well. The Pact Ring? I was planning on giving this to you soon, but you beat me to the punch. But this ring is so important. So is the ring you just gave me. There's no one I'd rather have by my side, Diamant. I won't take no for an answer. Don't worry. I enjoy fighting beside you too much to turn this down. I accept your gift. Amazing. It's like I can feel the history of the Divine Dragons. The history of Lethos itself. I feel the history of Brodia within your ring as well, Diamant. It's changed in form between fathers and sons. But that item tells the story of my kingdom. If we hope to add worthwhile stories of our own, we'd better help each other out. I'm not worried. When we work together, there's nothing we can't do. I vow to protect you, Divine One. From this point on, I will always fight by your side. Fire Emblem, engage. <laughs> 